This is your money? Yes, I heard him crumble it up. Thank you. Thank you. All that's that ain't my money. money. That's my money. Eight, nine, ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, Look, 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 look. Come here, come here, come here. Come, yeah, I mean, come, come here. I'm, 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 I'm telling you, 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 I'm Sir, you've been watching me the whole time. Not I that. seen you take it. I seen you crumble. Sir, it. just tell it. Not me. If I'm right, it's gonna be around a thousand dollars. If I'm right, and like I told you, I just went to Wendy's. I saw. I seen you steal. No, sir. Um, if you if you don't mind, I just wanna sit down so y'all don't try to sit down. I don't wanna do nothing. All I know for a fact is I know what I know, and I seen it. I just wanted you guys to trust me. That's why I was just acting a little irate, but I'm perfectly fine. You know what I'm saying? I'm sorry. I wasn't no, trying. Sir. I wasn't trying to expose that you. That is not anything. me, bud. 
Brother, I just seen you steal my money. It was no reason no, sir. to pop my rubber band, brother. It was no reason for you to pop my rubber band off my money. I didn't pop your rubber band off your money. I heard it. Me and you just spoke about it. You heard him agree to it when, 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 first, when I first got I said, I heard you did rubber band. You said, oh, I had to do something, something, something. It's okay. It's okay. I know. I just, I just witnessed here today. Mr. Chapman went in my money. He separated my money. He was trying to steal it, and I caught him. He put it in between his legs. As his, uh, as his colleagues approached me, he worked it towards the door. He tried to make it seem like I was lying. I'm not going anywhere. No, I'm in full custody of, 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 of these officers. I'm being detained. I'm not going anywhere. I don't want any problems. I'm not armed. I didn't do anything wrong. I was just pulled over for a traffic stop. He just tried to steal some of my money. Okay, we're hearing you, but there's no need to say all of that. No, I was, no, I was just looking at the you. camera. No, I just know how okay. it goes. You know what I'm saying? I don't want to talk. My cameras on the entire time. All right, yes, so let's take it down. Yes, ma'am. I apologize. I'm so sorry. Yes, ma'am. So, what are we going to do about this problem? Because you just tried to steal someone. No, money. sir, I'm not I did trying not. To put any allegations on him. I'm not trying to say anything. I'm not I'm not using my words like to try to hurt anybody. I just know what I know. And then I don't even like the fact, but I know you guys have like special protocol. I don't even like the fact that he just tried to steal and nobody like stood up for you. Like nobody was like, I, okay, nobody saw anything but I seen saying, everything. But nobody would saw anything that you said. I appreciate saw, it, Mr. Okay? Morris. You his sergeant. Yes. Yes, he is my sergeant. Oh, sir, I have 2020 and I can read. I remember when you called him out. I could tell you everything he said to you. Perfect timing. This is perfect. Perfect did you call me out this time because you didn't know the protocol to how a federal warrant was supposed to be taken care of. Correct and correct. That's correct. That's the reason why I, I called him out to ask. But you just separate. Whoa, so what was the purpose of you separating my money while you gave her money? While you just watched her count my money out in full? Because you just wasted an uh, uh, you, you wasted an evidence folder. Because now she has to rewrite a totally different number. So if I would have agreed to the number that I didn't know when she asked me, then I would have been like ridiculed or foreseen as a liar or something. That's why I didn't answer your question, man, because I said that I had just went to Wendy's. I believe that's my receipt. I only ordered a 10-piece nugget, and I ordered like a fry and something. Mm -hmm. So I didn't know the actual amount of the money. All I know is when my girlfriend got off work at 5 o'clock, I was supposed to give her that money for the rest of the bills, and she was going to get her car back. I was in a car with this week. That's why I wasn't in my own car, man. That was my girlfriend's car, Donna Alexander. That's why I went. You initially pulled me over, and y'all probably have my phones. You can see the call record. I called her at like four or something to let her know, babe, I'm being pulled over in your car. And my eyes, I thought it was done for the T tag, the temporary tag thing, the sticker. But like, that was it was initially just for your speed, I promise. You. No, I apologize, sir. I apologize. Okay. I'm just trying to do what I got to do. But I know for a fact what I heard. I have 2020 vision. I'm not a criminal. I don't do things that I'm not supposed to. I heard him tampering with that rubber band. Okay. That rubber band was on that money because my girlfriend gave me the money this morning and told me I wasn't even supposed to be in her car. I just took it because I didn't want to be Ubering around all day and my girlfriend had a car and she was going to work. I was supposed to be picking her up off Central Act at her job at her little where she do cosmetics at. With that money, we were supposed to go to the bank. What's his name? I'm pretty sure when y'all check the car, y'all What's his name? Little Chase. What's your, what's, what's your full name? Moncri Tari Moon. M O N C R E. Okay. Last okay, name. Mr. Moon, do, do we have all, all your information? Yes, sir. But I want to know what y'all going to do about Mr. Chapman. Okay. You, he was just caught at work. Mr. Moon. With evidence. Mr. Moon. I'm, I'm going to do my job, all right? So. I want it wrote down. I'm not going to lie. Not listen, to Mr. Morris. I'm not going to cut you off. Look, look, listen, there's nothing that I could give you right now to tell you what, 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 what I'm going to do. But like, what I can tell you what I'm going to do is if... Hey, I want to thank Upside for sponsoring this body cam. Upside is a free app that gets you cash back on daily essentials like gas, groceries, and dining. When I pump my gas, I can use Upside. I mean, do you see how happy I am here? Just look at this. There are over 85,000 gas stations, grocery stores, restaurants on the Upside app, ensuring that cash back is always just around the corner. And yes, this is actual real cash back. No confusing rewards or points or credits just actual money you can transfer straight to your bank account. So once you have the app, claim an offer for whatever you're buying on Upside. You pay as usual using a debit or credit card and follow the steps on the app and get paid. To find out how much you could earn, click the link in the description to download Upside or scan the QR code on screen and use our promo code BODYCAM and get an extra 25 cents back on every gallon on your first tank of gas. That's promo code BODYCAM for an extra 25 cents back on your first gallon of gas. If if you're alleging that that he did something, I, I, obviously, I said, did you extra money? no, like it's not hundred. 
Oh, it's 900. It's, just, it's, right uh, it's, it's, it's 900. Okay. So, so like if a, if a, you're alleging that Officer Chapman did, you know, did Alleged, something wrong. So you guys don't. Listen, uh, listen. I'm, 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 I'm telling you exactly what I'm going to do. Do do not parse every word I'm telling you. I'm telling you exactly what I'm going to do. All right. Is that I, I I have to get on the phone. I have to call my supervisors to uh, you know to run it up the chain. All right. But you're but but uh, you're 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 still going going to jail. Oh yeah, I understand. Okay. I wasn't trying but, to. But but like that's why I'm I'm asking you if you gave them all of your information on how to get in contact with you. Did you do that? Saying, name. Only, only yeah. My first name last name. Do do a uh, do a uh, we have numbers. address and uh, and a phone number. Pull off a gold pan. Yes, sir. Let's we'll see if you get your phone number. You have everything else. Uh, you, uh, you can take my girlfriend's number seven zero four. Uh, Okay, you you'll be hearing here here from us soon. All right. Yes, sir. Uh, all right, thank you. I would like um, for you to write down um, uh, Sergeant Moore's name. I would like for you to write down uh, uh, Mr. Lack's name. I would like for you to write down your name and um, Mr. Chapman's name. Right, and it's not, like, it's not like it's not like I just don't want to forget it. You feel let me finish Yes, ma'am. My information is also on the citation approach. Yes, I appreciate it, sir. I appreciate you guys for like analyzing the situation because, like, if it wasn't said like this or seen like this or foreseen like this, nobody would have believed me. You feel what I'm saying? And I just wanted you guys to believe me. And I'm sorry if I seemed irate or another dollar in your pocket. Or I'm sorry if I seemed like I was doing too much. I just wanted you guys to believe me without me having to do anything like to show you guys. You feel what I'm saying? Like try to grab him or try to like reach in his car and grab the money while I heard it. You feel what I'm saying? And I know it was a lot going on. Yes, ma'am. I need to Well, I just know like y'all be like. Yeah, I don't do that again at the uh, at intake. Yes, ma'am. Catherine, his ID is on the dashboard up there. Okay. Um, do you want to put your name in my evidence file? Can I get like y'all names right now? Yeah. Thank you. Um, um, I think everything is done. He's not suspended or anything, right? No. Okay. AP is done. I don't think there's anything else that needs to be done. Um, I encountered him. He was speeding 68 miles an hour, 45 miles an hour zone in Harris by the plaza. Okay. That's what I thought. Alright. Um, everything's been okay. I've had no problems here. Did you give him a copy of his citation? His citation was with you. Did you give it to her? No. Can I get a copy of it? And I'll put well, it with it the was, property? I know I saw it earlier. Now that was an old citation. That's an old one? Yeah. I, I think that's I think that's it. Was that it? Yeah, I'm pretty sure it's it. Huh? That's the one uh Oh no, that's what we're right. Let me go get I'll just print another one out. Yeah. If you could Yep. Did you have any other property before she takes you down? Any other property with you? What do you have? Do you only have his money right now? Yeah. Remember, your phones went with uh, your bu your buddy that was in the car. Let me see if there's anything else that's yours before she takes you down. Uh, uh, I know, like you're not supposed to really. T what did he try to tell you when, you when he walked over? There? He's claiming that he didn't try to steal it, but we all saw. What we saw. Out of I'm not gonna so. lie. I don't have nothing, nothing to say to you. I appreciate you, sir. No cap, like for real. Yeah. I really appreciate you for, for at least like, like, even in the playing field. Like you feel what I'm saying? When I say that, I mean like, like just not treating me like trash right. because of like. And I, I assure you, like I pretty, I'm pretty sure you guys hear this all the time. Everything I've said since you've seen me it has been. I know the, and, the truth. You can I, look up that I just had court. I want you to know also that. What's happened today? From not even this I don't, moment. I don't, not even I, this don't, I don't think all you guys are dirty. I don't yeah. think because you could have been did something crazy to me. You seen everything before they got there. I know that yeah. you're a good cop. I don't think that all cops are like that. I don't. Well, 
I, I just wanted it. you guys to see that. Well, the arrest, the whole entire thing, that was the furthest thing from what I wanted to happen today, okay? I, I, I was out there doing traffic enforcement, and I clocked the at yeah, I showed you the LiDAR. That's, and I was that was the entire you, reason. That, that wasn't my car, so when I heard you tell them, like, I thought he was going to get... So, so I know you didn't have that I was trying to pull no, over. Me. I didn't even I know. know. I was trying I to know. pull over. You well, I knew you had it in gear still, so that's why everything's okay. But. I appreciate you, officer. And I appreciate you under the circumstances with you having a federal warrant and everything. You being I'm just saying, cool, because I don't know what's going on. And, and I appreciate I wouldn't that. lie to you guys. Okay. Like I said, I appreciate it too. Oh. And, and like, like I don't know. Like I'm very observant. Like my mom was military, so I was taught to just watch everything first. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like I just told her when he like. I don't know. I'm big on I'm big on like energy. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. like I've been seeing like I seen the tears come to his eye in the car. I seen him swallow real hard right there. He keeps walking like because he's he's gonna try to get you guys to believe like the fact that he didn't steal that. But there's no way like my money was in a rubber band. That's why I keep it like that. Like, I have OCD. You know what I'm saying? Anybody knows me? I have OCD. That's why I kept. That's why all the hundreds was facing the same way. Yeah. That's why all the videos, I, I, when I didn't tell her how much money was taken, I really just wanted her to recount it out to see if hundreds was missing or fifties was missing. He didn't have time to go through the whole stack. He had time to remove the rubber band and put the rubber band back. That's all he had time to do, but I heard it. It's elastic. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Like, that's I'm gonna, all I wanted to say. I'm, I'm not grab. trying to impersonate him. I'm not trying to talk your head off. I, I just you. wanted you to know how I knew. Like I said, I'm not disrespecting your colleague. I'm just glad you guys seen it, and, 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 and I just want like, if one of you guys can't, I just want you guys to be able to write you guys' names out. And that's just because, like, I, I appreciate it. Yeah, I appreciate and, it. And that citation's got my information, but I'll give it to you again. My last name's Black, code number five. And you looked over that citation, and you made sure everything... Everything's on there. Uh, yeah, and and it's then, just traffic stuff on my end. And, like, you know that, like, um, as soon as you told me, I seen you say, get over. As soon as you told me, that I put my signal on, I got over. Yeah, and I appreciate that. And appreciate it. And boss. when it comes down to court, when it, all that stuff goes down, that's stuff I'll explain to them and say, hey... I had no problems here, especially under the circumstances of you having that federal warrant. But pulled over, compliant, no resisting it whatsoever. Yes, we had no problems at all. I appreciate you, Officer. Okay. Have a nice day. Thank you. I'm going to get the rest of your property and move it over here. Okay? Thank you, brother. Hey, look, again, like, if y'all call my phones and my little cousin answer, like, like, like the, 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 the keyboard there, There'll guy. be someone else getting in contact with you about it, an investigator of some sort. Yeah, I was, I, I was trying to be, like, as manly as possible. I was, I was trying to, like, not let not, like, not to let my girlfriend get involved. Anytime you make an allegation like that, whether it's true or not, they're going to contact you. There'll be a full investigation. That's how it goes. Thank you, sir. I appreciate right. it. Uh, let me get his chargers. I think these are his phone chargers. Uh -huh. don't, don't apologize. Don't apologize. All right. Like, I'm putting these on you because... That's what I have to do by policy, all right? So. What this is, is it's going to be a administrative interview, all right? So, like, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not looking to uh, hit me up for any <coughs> charges or anything like that, all right? This is, this is strictly about what transpired today. Outside. Yep. Okay. Yes, sir. So, so we're gonna talk about from from the time you were pulled over. I'm sorry. Let me introduce myself. All right. Let me take a step back. My my name is Sergeant Morris. I am the second shift sergeant, patrol sergeant for the University City Division. You you understand who who I am? Yes, sir. Okay. And you are? Uh, last name. First name? Uh, M O N C R E. Okay. Birthday. So, the the point is to just an administrative interview. So, anytime there's there's an allegation of wrongdoing by a police officer, obviously, a supervisor has to look into it. You, yes, sir. You, you understand that? Yes, sir. Okay. And you also understand that we all have these these nice body worn cameras that that's attached to us, right? Yes, sir. Okay. For like when we come in contact with the citizens. Yes, I understand. Okay. So, let's uh, start off when uh, you were pulled over. Can I? Can you tell me what happened? Uh, well, like, what, well, like, obviously. So, like, so, like, you, so you, so you, so pulled over for speeding. Let's just simply, let's stipulate to that, right? Yes, sir. Okay. Officers ran, ran your name. You, you, you had a warrant for the U.S. Marshals, right? Yeah. 
off and then officer chapman showed up um and uh, you was arrested correct not officer uh chapman i think his name was officer uh i know it was chapman right the dude yeah what's the lady i thought the lady name was uh casperson casperson that's what it was a different kid uh all right honestly got i was leaving wendy's uh uh, I uh, put my right signal on to um, get over. Uh, apparently, I guess I was speeding or whatever. Got pulled over by Officer Lack. Yeah. Uh, cool dude. He ain't, you know what I'm saying, do too much. He just told me that he had to detain me due to the fact that I had a, a federal warrant. Mm -hmm. That much, I don't know nothing about him. Just, you know what I'm saying, here with y'all. But mm -hmm. from there, he was on a dirt bike, so he had to call. Uh, a bag of officer. Backup officer, mm -hmm. to, you know so at that point he could he could, he could uh, contain us or whatever. Um, everything was cool. Nobody, uh, well, I didn't resist or anything. I didn't know what was going on. Still don't. But make a long story short, uh, my property was took off of me by by, by who? By uh, not lack. Um, what's his name? Chapman. By uh, Mr. Chapman or whatever. Uh, my girlfriend pulled up to the scene of the crime. Uh, to uh, like uh, to get the uh, the the money, but he told her, which he had also told me, the money was on my possession, so it had to stay with me, which wasn't a problem. So uh, from then on forth, uh, I uh, remained in the back of Chapman's car, so my property was on the front seat the whole time. Mm -hmm. So as we pulled up to the uh well we uh, remained on the scene for about 20 minutes um then we were clear to leave the scene while you were people uh as we were clear to leave the scene i just asked him get okay, hold on for a second your uh, money how was it packaged uh it was all forward in um uh hundreds and fifties uh um it was uh it was like all like chronological order like hundreds fifties okay and then, um, and, and like, did did have anything on it? As far as oh, a rubber band. Okay. Do uh, do you remember the color of, of the rubber band? Uh, I think it was like a whitish gray, like not this color, the regular color of the rubber bands, like the white off whitish right. grayish color. So like that, like that uh, tan skin tone color. Yes, sir. Okay. All right. So as we pulled up to the scene, after he had already told everybody, like his property has to stay with him, and there wasn't no problem, like nobody was aggressive. Everybody was doing their job, their protocol, you feel what I'm saying? Make a long story short, we pulled up. Like, um, I just, like, was asking, like, each officer that I encountered, like, what was going on with me, like, what was happening, mm -hmm. like, so I could know, like, how to better my situation as mm -hmm. far as, like, getting out. So, uh, long story short, when we pulled up, uh, we were waiting for Officer Lack to get finished with his report so that they could start, like, mm -hmm. transferring me yep. as, uh... As everybody was waiting, I guess officers were leaving out, and they were saying that they would volunteer to transport me uptown to help you guys, I mean, to like help each other out. Mm -hmm. uh, he told Officer Casperon, whatever. Casperson. Yeah, Casperson, that she could take me, and then uh, he told Lack to um, like, well, as we soon as he pulled up, first he called you outside to, mm -hmm. to get like confirmation of what was he supposed to do with a federal um, a warrant person. Mm -hmm. So uh, he was already coming out. Make a long story short, as um, uh, Lack started bringing out the envelope for the uh, inventory, I mean, uh, for my stuff, uh, like my property, um, I heard I heard the rubber band being tangled with. That's when I asked the question out loud. I said, uh, why would you take a rubber band off the money? And I can't quite remember the answer he gave me, but he confirmed to me that he took the rubber band off the money. And... Like, it's my property. I'm a man, so I'm going to watch my belongings mm -hmm. the whole time. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. And like I had stated, when Lack pulled me over, I was eating Wendy's. And that money was bill money. Like, it's on y'all cameras that when my girlfriend pulled up, she asked me for the bill money. Mm -hmm. So he told her, like, keep the money in my possession, which was, you know what I'm saying, which was cool, which was in you guys, as well, which was in his possession at this point. Mm -hmm. So as I was being transferred into the car, I heard the rubber band pop. That's when I asked the question, like, oh, like, what you doing? Like, like, what were you doing with the money? And he was, like, basically, like, like he confirmed that he was doing something, but he just didn't say what, or I don't know if I missed it, but I know we was, like, so, it so was like, five so of us so right you there. Don't, you don't recall what he said. I don't recall, but like I'm saying, it was you. five of us right there, so I know one of the cameras probably picked up on it, or his should have, okay. which I know his probably was off because he was stealing my money. 
but he kept like trying to make it seem as if my eyes were playing tricks on me and i heard the rubber band pop and the whole while long on like what you guys would see on your cameras i was talking to you guys rather well really at you guys because i was watching him and the whole while long i kept seeing him move his legs and as soon as i said it and put it out there he tried to put the money in between his legs and hand her over the stack when i seen the size of the stack and Officer Casperon asked, asked me how much money was it. I didn't want to tell you guys the exact number because I wasn't sure what he had took from the stack. All I was sure of was that the way that I placed the rubber band on the money wasn't the same. It wasn't. Because I have OCD. But also... Hey, uh, sir, let me call you right back. <laughs> yes, sir. I'm, 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 I'm talking to him right now. Okay, so like, so like, are you um to stop this interview with them? Because I'm speaking to them right now. Got you. Got you. Okay. Right. Yes, sir. Thank you. No, no, sir. But I'll call you back in a second. Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's see. So basically, so basically, the money. Oh, oh, uh, Somebody hired me. Said to stop this interview. Yes, sir. Okay. There's there's people coming in to uh, to speak with you and investigators about that situation. Yep. Like I told All you, right. I'm sorry, sir. I me, apologize. I wasn't me, trying to make hey, the situation hey, hey, bigger hey, than it hey, was. Hey, hey. I just didn't want to be perceived hey. as a liar. Stop. No, I just seen on TV. Hey, chill just, out, man. Stop. Stop. Stop apologizing. I just don't want to make listen. Like, um, listen. Listen. Listen here, man. Right is right, wrong is wrong. Yes, sir. All right? CMPD takes this seriously. Yes, sir. Now, I always try to say that another way because I feel like cursing right now, right? But what I can tell you is that we take you this... You heard what I said. But, like, right? we take this seriously, all right? I don't so, think like, you guys so, are all dirty cops. Chill out. Chill out. Let me, let me finish my, my, my statement here, okay? We take this seriously, all right? Yes, sir. So, like, when I told you that, that I was going to do everything on, on my end to, to ensure that... The, like we we get this right, and I was, I was gonna call call you back. I meant that. I appreciate it. Because if a, if a somebody's doing doing wrong, we we need to figure that out fast. All right. Yes, let, me, let, let me see your hands. Yes, sir. I got told Miss Mr. Smith, I appreciate you guys. You thirsty? Um, a little bit. I appreciate. Which you one to drink? Some water. Cool. Okay, give me a second. Pull up the security desk. All right. Okay. So, like, this is what's going to happen, all right? We we have people coming in. Obviously, they, they have to talk, talk to you, all right? So, um, I, I'm going to have to hold on to your weapon right quick, okay? Yep. Go ahead. Take just take the uh, whole holster off. It's one of them. Two of us. Okay. Um, Sergeant Burke and you know one of the de one of his detectives going to come and speak to yeah. to you, all right? So just chill out, relax. Do Do you need anything? No, I'm. I'm I just want. To Apologize, to everyone. I say, man, I one of these things, dude, and I'm I'm sorry. Hey, brother. Yeah. Um, anything to drink or anything? Else? No. Mm. I just want to say, I'm sorry. Gotcha, well, we're gonna walk out of here. And Close the door, okay, until you're okay, buddy. All right. Uh, let me know if you need anything, all right? I'm, I'm good, Sarge. I, I appreciate it.